Today on Steel Valley Vintage, we have a jar of Vaseline from the 1950s and a container of Vaseline from 2022. And we're going to compare both of these here in a couple of minutes to see if the consistency is the same. And we're going to look at how well this Vaseline from the 1950s held up. We even have the box that this Vaseline from the 1950s came in. And we were going to look at the background of this. It was made in New York, New York, United States, Chessboro Manufacturing Company. And it was invented by a gentleman named Robert Chessboro, or Chessboro. He was a 22 year old chemist who traveled to a town near where I grew up, which was Titusville, Pennsylvania, where one of the first oil wells was found by a man named Edwin Drake, I believe, named Drake's Well, that I visited as a youth. And I believe there is still a museum there to this day in Titusville, Pennsylvania. Titusville, Pennsylvania. This bottle of Vaseline, as you see before you, is from, I believe, the 1950s. You can see the blue seal package on top. You can see the packaging on the back with a soothing dressing. The Vaseline that was discovered in 1859 by the 22-year-old chemist was originally sold in 18. 70. In 1916, I found a fact about Vaseline in which it became a wartime staple as it was used for our military and for the soldiers to help with them as they had a condition called trench foot as they were in fighting in World War I and they were having difficulty with feet with their feet and they're putting Vaseline on their feet to help with their wounds. As through reading this package, you can see that the petroleum jelly may be liberally applied to raw and abrased surfaces such as minor cuts, wounds, and burns, then bandaged with a clean cloth. And these are things that we use petroleum jelly or Vaseline today. It's amazing that this box is still here with this product from the 1950s. Even the top of it is here, even though damaged. Pretty interesting to look at this as a piece of history. We're going to open this 1950s jar of Vaseline, and we're going to compare it to the 2022 version and we're going to see if this Vaseline, which was deemed in the 1950s as a wonder jelly, is still in the same shape as it was in 1950. By looking inside, we can see that it's a little bit liquidy, as we can see there in the middle. But overall, it seems to have the same consistency as you would imagine it having today if we were to pull out and use Vaseline for a wound or for a cut or for an abrasion today. Let's put this on the one side. Now let's take the petroleum jelly from 2022. Look inside, very similar. Now this petroleum jelly is much thicker and a much more dense consistency and a much harder consistency as you can see as I tried to poke and prod into this petroleum jelly. And if we were to put this petroleum jelly beside 
that petroleum jelly of 1950, we can see that this petroleum jelly here is much softer in consistency and this Vaseline here. This Vaseline, the newer version, is much more dense and has a much harder consistency than the Vaseline from 1950. So there definitely is a difference in the consistency of both of these Vaselines. So this Vaseline obviously has lost some of its functionality from 1950, even though the colorization is similar, the consistency of it definitely has changed. So from comparing the Vaseline from 1950 to the Vaseline of today, we have seen some changes. I hope you enjoyed looking at an unopened or looking at a partially open, I'm sorry, bottle of Vaseline from 1950 on Steel Valley Vintage today and comparing it to a jar of Vaseline from 2022. Today on Steel Valley Vintage, we have a few more items that we will open as we continue this series on Steel Valley Vintage. Today, of course, we looked into the Wonder Jelly, which was invented in 1859 and first sold in 1870 as a jar of Vaseline from the 1950s. Thank you for watching and looking at Vaseline from 1950s, from the 1950s on Steel Valley Vintage. Thank you. Game over, man.